Hi, I am Abdurrafe. Here's my friend Nacha. He is also saying hi to you. Today I am going to tell you about line command in AutoCAD. My friend Nacha has some questions. what is line the answer is that the two points connect to form a line as you can see that two points a and b are connected to form a line type line or l and press enter for line command two different devices are used to draw line in AutoCAD number one is keyboard and second one is mouse First of all, we discuss about keyboard, how to draw line with the help of keyboard. There are two ways to draw a line with keyboard. Number one is relative point entry system and second one is polar point entry system. First, a relative point entry system. It indicates a point distance and its direction positive or negative along XY. Negative sign indicates the direction of the line to right side of X axis and upward Y axis. Negative sign indicates the direction of the line side in X axis downward Y axis. My friend has some other questions in his mind. what are x and y axis what is origin what is x and y x and y axis The red line in AutoCAD show x-axis and green line show y-axis. Now we discuss about origin. That point from where x and y-axis started is called origin. Now x and y. x specifies the distance to x-axis and y specify the distance to y axis. Let's suppose we have to draw a line of length 20 units from the origin. Type line or L, press enter. Specify the first point, type 0 for x, type comma, type 0 for y, press enter or spacebar. A point is specified at origin. Now you have to specify the next point, press 24x, press comma. As we know, we are not going to y axis, so press 0 for y, press enter. Next point is specify AutoCAD, automatically connect these points and form a line. You can see that a line is generated from 0, 0, 0,0 to point 20,0 now is polar point entry system 
it specifies the point with angle to specify a point enter a distance and angle separate by angle bracket its general form is that k is the length of the line from the last point here you can see that this is the first point of the line and the length of the line is k now we will discuss about angle angle specifies the direction of the line if you want to draw a line to right side specify the angle as 0 or 360 degree in right direction 0 or 360 it is written as this or this if you want to draw a line to the left side specify the angle as 180 to the left side specify angle as 180 degree if you want to draw a line upward specify the angle as 90 degree upward direction angle is 90 k angle 90 if you want to draw the line downward direction specify the angle as 270 downward 270 general form is k angle 270 k is any number here we show you the angle in a trochaic zero ninety one eighty two seventy and three sixty. Now we will discuss about how to draw a line with the help of mouse. Click the line icon. with mouse the icon looks like this move your cursor to the drawing area specify the first point by left clicking move your cursor and specify next point let's practice it in autocad l and press enter here you can see on the screen specify the first point we start from the origin type 0 comma and 0 and again press enter here you can see first point from origin is specified now you have to specify the next point let's make a square of 20 units first we make this square with relative point anti system then with absolute point anti system now type 20 for x axis comma and 
type 0 for y axis press enter now you can see on the screen a 20 unit line to axis is generated and specified on the screen now we have to draw a line from that point to upward 20 units now type 0 comma and 20 enter now you can see 20 unit line and draw on your screen now we have to draw a line to left side of the x axis now type minus 20 comma 0 now we have to draw a line from that point to origin now you have to to specify the point 0 comma 0 or you can also click the or write close what is the function of close if you type close or C the first point and the last point is automatically connected now you can see I type C for close and enter automatically the first point and the last point is connected and a square is shown on your screen we make this square with a relative point and system now we will make the same square with polar point entry system okay we will raise it and now again type L and press enter or spacebar in AutoCAD enter and spacebar work as same there is no difference of enter or spacebar now first specify the first point the origin 0 comma 0 and enter now we have to draw a line to x axis to right side of 20 units type 20 and the angle symbol and specify the angle 0 or co you can also type 360 now we have to draw the same line of 20 unit to upward direction now type 20 the angle symbol and 90 degree now we will specify the direction to 180 20 unit angle and 180 now we can also specify as 20 angle and 270 or also type C to close these are the two types to draw a line with the help of keyboard you can also draw it or use the line command with your mouse on the top left corner you can see a line icon by clicking left click on it you can specify the line specify the first point second first second here you can also draw line with the 
help of mouse here I will show you something about line this is a separate line this is also a separate line this is also a separate line these are all separate line but we draw these line with the same pattern don't separate it but there is another type of line we discussed in our next lecture which is polyline which is different from the line in next lecture or tutorial I will show you the difference between line and polyline here you can notice that these are different and separate lines thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe our channel for more updates thank you